Hey, 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 what's up, what's up, what's up? I'm with uh, two of Singapore's finest, and uh, I think the Singapore finest, so you think the Singapore's finest, because they are Singapore's finest. Uh, I've got Shigga in the house. Yeah. You wanna talk shit? Here's some paper you can do to one. Quit saying you're famous, you can't even be Googled on. And I've got the one and only Vanessa. And just in case I need to S B E L L it, dude, here's another thing that I can do much better than you do. I just like to say here and now that uh, Monster was dope. Where did the thought come from? Thought process, you know, soul. Did you use heart? Did you use mind? Uh, or was it a, a combination of both both worlds meeting each other? Please, I, I've got enough asking. Please tell us. I'm like you guys who I think have been doing this for a really long time, you know, being MCs and I have full respect for that. Like, I'm not an MC by, um, you know, trade. I'm you can't see that now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, I started out, I guess, as a singer, but, you know, you know that I've always been a hip-hop girl. No doubt. And uh, I definitely put a lot of thought into actually writing lyrics that I felt were meaningful and were honest because sometimes when you look at hip-hop these days that is lacking um, and if you if we all understand hip-hop we all know it's about truth it's about struggle um, and I wanted to put as much of that into the verse as I could I started out doing music professionally when I was pretty young yes and you know uh, in Urban Exchange we were also signed to like EMI and to Universal yes. and I think more recently I've kind of stepped away from the pop mainstream world right. and that was a conscious decision and I think that not to say that that world doesn't have good people in it um, but yeah I, that that verse came from a lot of the experiences that were not so positive but I think that I hope that I managed to flip that around into something positive in terms of how I've journeyed as a musician. You can tell a monster from the way he opened his mouth and nothing come out but lies You should recognize every time he talks shit it's like stench from the trash Trying to school everyone else what you ain't got no class You know in hip hop I think at the end of the day at the minimal best yeah. right If we have beef let's fight through music man and let's just make it something that's... <laughs> let's put our hearts and souls into the creation of good stuff. And we can kind of healthily compete that way or say what we want to say that way. I think at the end of the day, as long as it builds and it grows, right. cool. Uh, Shiga, new single just came out. Yeah. Fall, but don't you ever dare just get up Tell a hater to hate, I'ma go hurt No Asians ever made it, well I'm about to be the first one It's actually the first single off my debut album Album, yes, of course And uh, it's called Let's Roll Yeah, Let's Roll Yeah, Let's Roll uh, It's it's actually, the beat was made by the architect This guy from Brand New Feeling So um, he gave me the beat, I kind of like arranged it everything And Don Richmond makes the whole song Nice And um, actually, Steam, right? Yeah, Steam Nice And if you can tell, if you listen to the song, you can tell like Vanessa actually laid down some background vocals on yep. the song itself. Yep. Are you in KL recently? Yeah. Uh, how, uh, how was it and uh, what were you there for? Uh, I was there for actually a show. It's called the Mo Movement Daily Treat. Yep. Was it? I had a fun time, but the the, play, the people in KL is just so it's just so friendly, you know, the whole vibe and everything. You just go there, you feel so welcome and everything. Everything is so chill. You know, in Singapore, everything is so hectic. Like, oh, we gotta get here in time, that kind of thing. For, the, for in K, people in KL, it's like, so, oh, let's just take our own time. Malaysia so, Bully, right? Yeah, Malaysia <laughs> Bully, yeah. yeah. I know, I know. I know, I know. The food they, is good, the people is good. Yeah, yeah I know, they live by the saying, you know. Debut album, when and uh, where can we expect it? It's gonna be out probably next year, about January, February. And it's uh, it's gonna be out for free at shigashay.com. Hey, for free. Yeah, man. Busted. Fucking good dude, man. Still on a big <laughs> shit. <laughs> I, I want to tell you all that uh, we will be performing the uh, Monster Song together, uh, the three of us, um, over at the Writers Festival um, at SMU, and I need you now. <laughs> Um, SMU on the 29th. <laughs> on the 29th, and uh, it's for Poetic Justice. 29th October. 29th October. Uh, it's for the show called Poetic Justice. Uh, we will be there. 
Um, the thing is, um, uh, the involvement for the two of you uh, will be much more than that. Um, tell us, uh, how, how, how do you feel when uh, opportunities like this come up? Because this is a particular writers' festival that's um, for the people, you know, for people to know not only us, but the fact that uh, our lyrics are very important, uh, what we have to say is very important. Uh, so we're going to make you a part of this. Uh, tell me how you feel. I feel very excited to actually be a part of it. And uh, I think it'll be a pretty interesting live performance when we perform Monster Live because it's not usually a song that you perform live. Yeah. And oh yeah, and by the way, we're going to do it uh, acoustic. Yeah, acoustic. So that's a pretty interesting combination. Yeah, I can't wait actually to hear all our verses on acoustic. <laughs> When I was uh, learning uh, uh, vocals in music and drama company, uh, I realized that all rappers can sing. But now you've just flipped the script. <laughs> all singers can rap. <laughs> so I actually need you to leave so that you don't take over the rap scene. Okay. I'm not going, I'm not going to so, take over uh, the rap We'll start with, uh, uh, both of you have the same line. Just finish it for me. Jack and Jill went up the hill to have a little fun. To make a baby. <laughs> Jack fell down and broke his crown because Jill was on one. <laughs> Mine was uh, Jack and Jill went up the hill to have real fun. Jack got mad, kicked Jill in the bum because she couldn't make him calm down. <laughs> uh, once again, thank you very much, uh, Vanessa. Thank you very much, Sugar. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, what do I have to say? Uh, watch out for this too. Keep your ears open for this too, because uh, they're the now, they're the tomorrow, and uh, to me, you guys are going to be forever. So thank you very much, guys. Thank, thank you so much. STS Tele V. Yeah. Yeah. All right, y'all. That was the first episode of STS Tele V. We've got more episodes coming up. So honestly, you got to subscribe to our channel. Just click the button somewhere around here. Yeah, that's right. And be a part of the flow. So thank you very much. And I uh, hope you guys enjoy it. Because uh, we enjoy it doing it for you. STS Telling V. That's the way we roll. Yeah. 2MFB. Soul and the soul and the groove. Yeah. Uh, 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 u